I am sure now that everyone is aware. Aware that few girls were asked to remove the hijabs that cover their hair. But how well do you know our story? Do you not know that it is mandatory? Dressing up as a visibly Muslim woman is an assertion of my identity. And you try to stop us in the name of uniformity? Hijab, it's a symbol of my faith that I choose to wear. I am in no need of a liberator or a savior. It is my will, my fundamental right. Stop obstructing us with your might. My hijab, it doesn't weigh me down. I wear it like a precious crown. My niqab doesn't stifle my voice. It is my life, my choice. No one can touch a six turban. It is an offense not worth a pardon. Cause it is his fundamental right most certain. None can disparage a nun's garb. If so, I will be their rock, their vanguard. Why then do you belittle my head scarf? The woman who sees without being seen causes you so much frustration that on her you close the doors of education. Hijab is my constitutional privilege. Go tell that to your masters who have your patronage. What happened to peace and harmony? Do we live in Nazi Germany? And go to those wearing a saffron shawl. You can scheme and plot, but I will still stand tall. You are welcome to wear it every day. You choose to undermine me with your cosplay? Your mischief is no secret anyway. At my niqab, the world did scoff until the pandemic called their bluff. Now everyone wears a face mask and I proceed to have the last laugh. My veil is integral to my identity. It essays modesty, dignity and humility. It liberates me from all those who stare. I feel relaxed and secure as it covers my head. I too am a citizen of this republic, even though I wear a special fabric. My India is beautiful as it is diverse. So many colors have hair come to merge. Remember, if you dilute the other shades of the tricolor, it becomes dim, fainter and duller. Lastly, I warn you, hands off my hijab. India is echoing with the slogans of Inqilab.